What's up, ladies and gentlemen? It's Crusader the Designer here, and another issue has come up in the PvP portion of Destiny to where there is an exploit with the Night Stalker Shadow Shot Super to where it can be casted an unlimited amount of times, or at least until the player dies. And with Trials of Osiris and Iron Banner around, you know, it's a really big issue and it is a huge problem that needs to be addressed immediately. So if you guys don't know what it is, it's basically the, like I said, the hunter can cast Shadow Shot um, unlimited times or until they die. All it takes is firing two shots and um, pausing your menu and then it refills your super bar back to, back to full and then you can cast two more, pause it, rinse, repeat. And uh, I don't have gameplay of, of it being done here. I don't want to deal with that. I've seen it happen a lot in Iron Banner during my shift today, and it was uh, me and my teammates have reported the players have who's done the exploit. Huge, 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 huge problem that needs to be fixed right now. Um, but why I'm making this video is that I want to talk about with you guys is that my chat today said that Bungie is not going to address this problem. A lot of people in my chat today said that Bungie is not going to handle this. And I highly doubt that. I had to disagree because with Iron Banner event and Trials of Osiris coming up, there's no way that this is not going to be addressed. And I don't mean addressed as in fix where the exploit is patched and you won't be able to do it anymore. I mean as in banning the people or temporarily banning or restricting them from PvP for a set amount of time. Now... There are other similar situations to where exploits were used. You guys all know the Hammer Titan spam glitch. The uh, If you guys don't remember, uh, people were banned for uh, using the exploit on the Crotus End raid where you, uh, I believe you, it was something like disconnecting your your console from the internet when you down Crota and he stays down. People were banned for that, or at least temporarily banned or restricted, whatever you like to call it. Um, People were also banned for using the um, the melee, not the melee, uh, the grenade supercharge glitch. If you guys don't know what that is, the hunter had the uh, gunslinger hunter scatter grenade would um, would do damage on a uh, a dead body, also refilling the super at a super fast rate. And uh, not gonna go into that, but it's another exploit that's been fixed, and people were banned for that as well. And um, if not, and if I'm completely wrong about this, then if Bungie is not gonna take any action, at least before Trials of Osiris, and I already shared you share with you guys my thoughts on the uh, Sunbreaker Titan, how it's gonna be a nightmare in Trials of Osiris for some people. Um, if they don't, then at least I hope this video gets to someone from Bungie, Deej, Cosmo, or someone. I don't know. But it's pretty, pretty bad. And um, if you guys are doing it yourself, then um, I highly recommend don't do it. Because there's a difference between it's something like Glitch where that's out of your control and uh, something that... You know that's just being used to take advantage of now there's a difference like uh i don't know i can't even think of an example right now destiny had its fair share of glitches but um you know you are totally in control of exploiting this and should you choose to do it then you're more than likely going to get uh you're going to get temporarily banned and that's why i believe that bungie is going to take action against people who are using this exploit because you are in full control of doing it or not and you are fully aware of what it does because you had to have learned it somewhere, right? I mean, maybe if you did it once or if you fired off into the, into nowhere not actually using it against players to your advantage and you know, in the Iron Banner event then, yeah, you're probably gonna get wrecked. <laughs> but that's just my thoughts on it, guys. I wanted to make this video because there's quite a few people who believe that Bungie is not going to take action for this video. And uh, I just wanted to share you guys with my thoughts why they think they are and or why they think they should. Because it's just... I'm... I honestly, as Destiny player who was looking forward to do Trials, I am actually kind of like... 
um, second guessing uh, of attempting trials this weekend. I really, honestly, genuinely feel like I, I don't know if I should. I just we're just gonna have to wait and see what happens. But yeah, have a great night, guys. Crusader Designer here. Peace.